To the play date. We got a lot of fun this year. We're, we're back. Yes. We're this week. We're back from Toy Fair. You rest it up. Are you resting uh, up? Yeah. I'm wearing some heels. So yeah. You're wearing really feet. cute heels. Like, kitten heels. You kitten you heels. What? What? I thought that. I, I think your shoes really win. Thank I really you. do. I think Barbie. your shoes win today. But they're not magic shoes like Barbie's in the pink shoes. Barbie, Barbie in, in the, the pink, pink shoes. shoes. That's her newest direct to DVD, isn't Correct. it? Correct. It's very good. It's, oh, okay. Video Boy okay. has seen it. He's he, he is our film critic, he our resident it. film critic. Two thumbs up. <laughs> Seven see it again points. Seven see oh. it again points. What's the story? Okay, so I will tell you the story um, by showing you the dolls. Barbie stars as Kristen Faraday, and she is a ballerina. She aspires to be a great ballerina, and she puts on these sparkly pink ballet shoes, and she's transported into a magical world where, for some reason, exactly, she has to defeat the Snow Queen by dancing two of her favorite ballets as Odette from Swan Lake and Giselle from Giselle. And really? also, Ken is there as Prince Siegfried from, I don't know, Swan Lake, maybe? Swan Lake. Okay. I think. No, Siegfried... What? I'm not familiar with Giselle. I'm not sure if Siegfried's in Swan Lake. I don't know my ballet as well as I should. Oh, it's okay. Uh, the stories are... So, what? But, but, what, so... but what makes them special? I mean, <laughs> I grew up with I grew up with the classic ballet of the red shoes, which had a much gorier ending when she put on the red shoes and she couldn't stop dancing. Is that dancing. Really ballet? It I've was, never seen it. Well, it was the red shoes was, about, was a fairy tale about a girl who wanted to dance and she put on the red shoes and she wished for it and she couldn't stop dancing and so they had, ultimately had to cut her feet off. That sounds like a normal fairy tale. That's that's the kind of thing my parents took me to see when I was yeah. seven. That's a great story. <laughs> it's a yeah. great story. It's a Hans Christian Andersen story. Of course. Really bloody. Of course. Uh, but this is a sweet story about this pink is a shoes. Sweet story. Yes. So basically, Ken does not dance. You can move his arms up and down and dance moves. You know, whatever. He's but knocking out all the girls. These dolls over here do dance. So let's let's start over here. And which one is dolls. that? I think this one is Odette. Okay. I'm gonna say. And basically, she has special legs. You just push. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Just this is why I did not go further in dance class. And she does not push <laughs> off. So you push down and up. Actually, that's kind of cute. It is cute. But I have to point out that if she is in toe shoes, yes. and it's impossible to do that move probably from toe shoes unless you are a really prima ballerina. So yes. How would you know? Well, I studied dance for many you years. Took dance? I studied dance for many years. You took dance. I was a big guy and I could lift the girls, and that's why they liked me. <laughs> okay, sorry, go ahead. All right, so then this doll, uh, what did I say? This is Odette, this is Giselle. It's just the same thing. Push down and pop up in her legs, do an entree shot. Okay. Odette, Odette does it better. Oh. <laughs> So then this doll over here... But you know, here, the thing about Giselle is, is yes. when Gelsey Kirkland did it, it was all about the, the tour jeté and, the, and the, all of that. Anyway. Plie. No, plie, that's just a basic move. Go ahead. Yeah, no. Okay, so, so then this, this is Barbie is Christian Faraday. Because... So you need all three dolls if you're really going to bring this to yeah, life. Exactly, yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> so she has the magical transformation. I'm going to make sure that I do it right. Okay, she, now she's... Where she okay. spin, and the skirt keeps spinning. Oh... <gasps> Okay, come on. That's Magical that's really that's really cute. They've been doing this for several years. That's actually one of the more fluid ones that they used to do. Yes. Remember when they had Barbie and the Three Musketeers? That was a little bit clumsy. <laughs> but the technology's gotten a lot better. So this is Barbie as Kristen Faraday. Barbie she's nineteen ninety nine because she's a feature doll. That's so right. These two are about twelve ninety uh fifteen ninety nine and then Ken is twelve ninety nine. They're really sparkly. They are very sparkly. Glitter. Okay, that's in the cracker. Anyhow, meanwhile, <laughs> we'll dance. Well, these girls are gonna dance off. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. So this Barbie is not a ballerina. This is Barbie. I can be President. dolphin trainer. <laughs> President. <laughs> um, everybody's saying like, okay. So yeah. so this is part of the I can be doll that's ride. Right. Barbie's had what over well over a hundred careers now. Yeah. She's been a busy girl. Wow. Yes. Um, and she's done it without a college right. degree, which is pretty I amazing. Know. So how does she how does she train the dolphins? Okay, I just want to preface this by saying this is really a doll that's designed to be used in water. But you need at least how about like coffee. I don't think that's gonna no, work. No coffee. <laughs> you need at least like nine inches of water. It's got to come up to her neck. 
And you also need something that's going to be wide enough to fit these dolphins because they're going to spin around. So like a bathtub mm. or a pool obviously would be great. We just don't have anything that's big enough like you that didn't in the prepare. office. You I'm didn't prepare. I'm sorry. I should have brought my swimming pool with You me. should have. Okay. But there's a switch on the back that you turn. I'm going to wind it up and... The dolphins spin around her and they go. Wow, those are fast things, dolphins. Like They're going to turn into butter. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and that's those are work. fast dolphins. Know, right? Do they slow down in the water a little bit? Because of the. the, Prob the probably, yeah. yeah just just because, because yeah. Like <laughs> yeah. Right, exactly. It's Barbie <laughs> Autoclave as well as. <laughs> This hoop can okay, be taken off if you don't want it. Um, All it, kidding aside. This is a dolphin squirt toy. Cute. This is really pretty adorable. Play. Yeah. And it this comes with little actually pretty adorable. fish pieces for the dolphins to eat because, of course, that's what you feed dolphins. Right, you do. This is actually this is actually really cute. How much is this? This is, uh, that's a good question. I don't know. Does it float? So you just put her in. You know, come, Lori did a very good review of this on our website. So come visit the review site and you can see you can see yes. what it costs. You can also see yes. our price matching thing and see what it costs and where it's in stock at that's the any right. given time. That's, so that's the best way to know how much it's going to cost. Is price Does it float? <laughs> no, it's the live it? price comparison tool. <laughs> <laughs> Does it float? I don't know. Probably, um, it seems pool. a little boring because we, we don't have anything to test it in. Tried to get Jim to install a pool. I know, and work. summer's coming, and we need to keep cool. But anyhow, this is this is actually really adorable. I know, it's just what does this switch fun. do? This actually, if you if you put the switch up, then you can um, wind it up, and it won't move until you're ready, and then you push it down. And Adorable. Very Absol adorable, absolutely adorable. Yeah. So, what do you need to, to do to become a dolphin trainer? I, I you know. Well, Barbie doesn't need to do anything. She just. But I guess you have to you have to study have biology to, I would and, think marine, and biology. So marine biology. You might need like a master's. Degree, you know, several actually. years ago, I got in the shark tank at the Barbie. aquarium of the oh, Pacific. Yeah? yeah, they called me Chum. They literally did. Were you in one of those? Were you <laughs> they in one really of those, did. Like, they kept calling the crew kept calling me Chum. Were you in a cage? No, no, I was like, actually oh. in the shark tank, and and they and they said to me, they, I said, aren't they going to bite my leg? I was in a wetsuit, and they said, no, we feed them sushi grade tuna. They don't want your old leg. So. It's uh, people are always so kind. Very okay, what's this? This is, this is adorable. A little wooden dollhouse. It's called box ha uh, box set dollhouse from Dig and Active. Okay. Um, there's actually two sides, so you've got this. <laughs> <laughs> that that was for the shark comment, not for the dollhouse. <laughs> you've got this outside decor here, and then you can flip it over, and there's a little balcony with the pool section over here. Um, it's just very cute because there are all these. I know we pieces. don't have a pool. The doll, the toys get pools. Piano, we don't get toys. A, a pools. Bench. All the pieces can come out. You can decorate the rooms however you want. And when you're done, the pieces store back inside. You do have to, um, there's some skill and strategy as to how to put the pieces together in order for this all to fold back up. But I'll show you just how this works. Oh, I just put that girl in. Basically, both sides fold up and then they have a little um, elastic thing. Get in there. Yeah. And then you can take it along with you wherever you go. That's actually really, cute. really cute. It comes with the two little dolls that do have opposable legs and arms. Penny. Penny. <laughs> Someone's in there. Someone's yeah. in there, right? They want to come out. But this is this is just an elastic, really nice, yeah. well well made classic play. Exactly. How much is this? Uh, it's about uh, forty dollars. Okay. It's made of wood. wood. Is it really wood? It's real. Yeah. It's real wood. It's not a composite. No, it, it it's not from actually. Ikea. If you, look, you can you can it's it's plywood. Get a get a shot of this video, boy, so we can we can show you know we can prove that it's plywood. No, it's really cute. I think this is really sweet. Yeah, it's, it's very cute. Plywood. Because there because you see plies, plies. See yeah, levels yeah, of, yeah, of plies. Yeah. Is that oh, really what it is? Somebody oh. flunked shop. <laughs> We were not offered shop. You didn't have before. shop. Not shop was Where did not, you learn no. to drive nails and things like that? <laughs> practice to practice okay this oh. is a, this is a this is a, a very new line of dolls uh just coming to the united states these yeah. are called lottie dolls as it's opposed to lottie da they're lottie no lottie l-o-t-t-i-e as you really, can see really they cute. stand on their own because they have flat feet the whole idea of this doll line <laughs> the whole idea of this doll line is that they're not supposed to be too old or whatever. They have flat feet. They don't wear makeup. They don't wear high heels. Uh, the company, really the company, yes, they dress very fancy. Well, this is the Snow Queen, and she's going to the ballet. So we're back with the Snow Queen. And look, see, she, she, she could do an entre shot from she that. Could. She could do a releve she right could. into an entre shot. First position, <laughs> second position, third, fifth. There's.
there's a fourth, but we never really did yeah. that in ballet. You did do two do fourth. We never did that when I took ballet oh, class, though. They fourth, kind of just like with fourth gl- position. Over fourth that. position is very stable for when somebody's running at you and you have to pick them up. Um, okay, oh. but fourth would be like I that. never made it okay. that far. Okay, so anyhow, <laughs> there were six different dolls. <laughs> And what ballet is that? Action. That's the end of Swan Lake when you shoot oh. the swans. Okay, so nice. <laughs> don't shoot the swans. Okay, so so this is the Lottie doll. I gotta show yes. the package sure. because I this is I mean the doll would be in the package, but I think yes. this is really adorable uh, packaging. They've done a really good job with it. These are coming to the United States. Are they out now here? Yes, they are out now here. I think they're available on Amazon. On um, Amazon, I'm not sure if they're available yet in specialty stores, but Amazon definitely. And this this is a great story. These are two people who who uh, the partners have both worked in the doll industry for a long time, and they decide to create these really sweet dolls. So I really yeah. love them. I think they're really neat. So. Indeed. What else have we? Do we have anything else? We do down here. We're going, now we're going to baby dolls. You can like, grab those two down there. This, this is a line called Baby Magic. You know, Maria's here today. That's exactly what she came in yeah, to get probably. away from. <laughs> Bring in the expert. Bring in the expert. Yeah, exactly. Mommy! This. The, the doll does not make those sounds. No. This is a very sweet, <laughs> cuddly doll with a vinyl face and a soft, and they cuddly smell like bottom. baby powder. Well, I think one of those smells like lavender as well. Oh, they do. They do. Adorable. And lavender is very calming. Oh, it it is. Babies. So this is baby powder. This is baby magic. I guess it's licensed mm-hmm. with the baby magic line of... Uh, Which, I don't know what you're talking I've never, I've never seen that. Baby magic exists, right? Am I making that up? I'm not making that up. Okay. Anyway, this is the Baby Magic um, <coughs> Bath Caddy Baby. It comes with a little caddy, so you can put your baby doll in there with three different pretend bottles um, of like soap and shampoo and a little rubber ducky and a towel. And that's the, the bath. Baby. I know, I love that song. The, the Baby you Magic. This is the Baby Magic Twins. Rubber ducky. Okay. Meanwhile. These are the baby twins, and they have little non-removable um, animal robes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't drink the bath water. <laughs> And they come with also pretend bottles of some bath. But really items. cute. I mean, I don't know if you can see this, but the eyes are, are you know, they're, they're glass-like plastic eyes, really sweet. They've done a really nice job with yeah. these. These are really nice. These are nice, and they're not that, they're not that expensive. They're about twelve ninety nine. Yeah. They're about twelve ninety nine. So. I can carry my baby with me everywhere. Okay. Look, flying baby. Ah. <laughs> okay. Let's give some stuff away. Yeah. That's what people come for. They don't care about the babies. They don't care about anything. They just want to get stuff. Hey! Oh, look! In no. package for you, the Angry Birds Blackbird. The, but and this bag is the bag is not a toy. No. Let me just stress that this bag is not, plastic is dangerous. Okay. Then we've got a talking plush clip-on uh, from Star Wars, and for the life of me, I can't think of what this thing is called. Help! Help! Who? What is this um, called? Isn't it? Right? Nobody knows. Right? Right? Oh, Jawa. I was like, thank you. Uh, I was so disappointed in myself. It's a Jawa. Does a Jawa go in an AT-AT? Yes. It does. Oh, look no, at it. No, 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 no. no, no. I, was I just wanted to say AT-AT because after all the stuff we found, that's the way I said. Okay, Shrinky Dings. Um, these are the new creativity kits. They These are from Big Time Toys. Uh, they're really, I, I've actually made some of these at home. I made I made the Hello Kitty set last weekend. Nice, because nice. That's what I do. And uh, this is really fun. Really yeah. fun. Great coloring. You can make it in your oven, right? Yes. You, uh, yes. Bake at 350 for three minutes. And it actually is sort of fun to watch it do that. And, and Barbie in the pink shoes. Does your head get hot? You go. My, now you can ha. also make Don't call me Sylvia Plath. Her on okay, which one is this one? This is Giselle. This is Giselle. And then you also get your own baby magic, baby twins. So. Which smells nice. delicious. It's a nice little package. It is a nice little package. I'm bored with girl stuff. Okay, then let's play with boys toys. But first, okay. if you want to win this, you oh, have yeah. to go to timetoplaymag.com, click on the play date where you'll find all the rules to enter. It's free to enter. By when? Until By... Wednesday, February 27th at midnight Eastern time. We're going to take a quick break and rechange the set. And when we come back, we got boys toys for you. Yay! Oh, Yay! <laughs> <laughs> And we're back because we can't get enough looking Rawr! ridiculous. Now we're monsters. Rawr! You're so scary. Wow. <laughs> that we're was beastie it. buddies. <laughs> we're beastie buddies? That's what these are called. They're beastie buddies. They have their own Sounds names. like a boy band. <laughs> Let's start one. 
Um, they have their own names and characters, and they come in three different sizes, so little kids can wear them, older kids, and even adults can wear them. They're from Geospace Play. We have to go find some adults, so we have to try. What are these from? Who are these from? Geospace Play. They're about $29.99 a piece. For a hat? For a, for a hat. But well, they it's also a, keep it's a you warm in the winter. Hat. Hat. It's a beautifully detailed hat. Scary. It's really warm under the lights. Do not wear this in your at-home TV studio, yeah. Sarah Palin. Um, okay, I, I, I'm, taking, I'm taking this That's off the because the bad word of the day. Because these are these are like wow. Woo! They're cute. They're, they're cute. cute. Look at their you know, eyes. Part of that, what are they called? Furries? That that big trend of the people wear these hats and then they. Wear them. It's a big. It's a. Go look oh, it up no, on the internet. Oh no! I know what you're go talking about. Go look it up about, on the internet. It's not just that they're wearing animal costumes. I don't like trends. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Okay. Okay. Look, but the monster baby's coming in. Ah! The baby monster. <laughs> don't worry. The dragon destroyer will take her. Baby ah! monster. Okay. Here, take the baby. Okay. So, we're. we're, we're <laughs> Video boy. Fits. This is tiny. Well, it I think tiny. that's the medium size. You should really be wearing a large. We didn't get this, though. Sorry. Large. Look at the size of that pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> we got boys' toys. We do. We got boys' toys. Well, let's just start with this one because it's right in the middle and then yes. we can throw it all away. This is the Hot Wheels Dragon Destroyer. It comes with one car. And the whole, Are we trying to the destroy whole the dragon? idea, well, the whole idea is that you're trying to avoid, I guess, being destroyed yourself by the dragon. I see. There's this little elevator, you bring the car up, and there are two ways you can go down. So I'm going to make it go down this front one, and beware, because the dragon's going to throw something out at us. Oh my gosh! It launched a projectile! Wow. Now, you can put yeah. it over here. And now is it going to chomp you? Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Okay, that chomped. That's kind of cute. Now it's really supposed to stay on, but then so you really need an awesome. extra car for this. Oh, set awesome! Because it's, all right, boys' toys are awesome. <laughs> the video need... boys reminding me, boys' toys are awesome. You need an extra car for this set because so... what happens is that if you have your car um, captured here, with you the dragon, can't get it out. <laughs> then you take this special launcher and you have to launch it to like the middle part of this uh, post here and that causes the dragon to fly off and then your captured car is released. And then you can also play with the dragon up here and fly right. around. But I, I, and I always want to play with dragons with pieces of road in his mouth. You can take the road out. You can take it out. Oh gracious. <laughs> Over. There you go. Oh, pretty. Okay. And you can still shoot the projectiles um, from that way as well. It only comes with one, so you have to go retrieve wherever we did it. Oh, okay. But anyway, but you can still make it shoot projectiles. Look at that. that the through process. the magic of television, the projectiles come flying. You have to make sure that there. the legs are like in that position, and then you go. Which position? You Which go. Go. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me tell I have so much there trouble there with this. There you go. go. His legs literally. You have That's because you're a girl. She was making fun of I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. This is kind of cool though. Look it's at all really this stuff. It's really cool. I know. So really, it comes with one car. Ooh, unbreakable with too. Two, but it doesn't, work, it doesn't work with all Hot Wheels cars. Just it doesn't say. work with all Hot Wheels no, cars. No, it does not. Sorry. Okay. okay. Now what are we doing? <laughs> this is how we clean up. This is how we clean up. Okay. This is the Hot Wheels Monster Jam from Mattel. Now it's it's called the. This is the Double Destruction Playset. So. What do I do? Well, you can do you can do one thing. You can just you know push on it and it'll, uh, it'll do it. It'll do a swell little jump. No. Now my here's my problem with all of these things yeah. is they're designed for two cars to get right. the most out, of them, but they only, only come with one. one car. So that's I just find that a little bit annoying. How they get you? I know yeah. it's just how they get you. Oh, listen to this, Mr. Gibbs. Okay, so you can you put change that up. It. <gasps> you can change that. Now here's here's this. Let's move this. Here. Let's move the other one out okay. here. And then we've got the nice thing here, and the idea is that you're going to jump up and smash into one oh. another. Three, two, one, fire! Ah. <laughs> that was oh, that was better. You have to really, you have to give really it a nice little down. smash. Okay. Three, two, one. Cool, right? Yeah. Little. little. No. <laughs> I I like these because I think That's I terrible. think these are I think these cars are really great four wheel. But the other thing we can do. We can also race, uh -huh. so we can put them on oh, okay. here, and we can see who's going to get further. One, three, two, one. Sweet. Sweet jumps. Sweet jumps. Uh, <laughs> anyway, really, I, this is one, there's a, there's a little bit of a learning curve on this is to yeah. get it. And this is the kind of toy that, well, when Jim and I were playing with this to do the review, we kept wanting to do it again and again. Yeah. Let's try it this way. Let's try it this yeah. way. Let's try it that way. Oh, wow. <laughs> 
There you yeah. go. So this this is part of the new uh, Hot Wheels Monster Jam line. Right. So you go pick up the other truck, okay. and I'll bring up the bring other up Monster the other Jam thing. And this other set you can really play with just one car if you want. Which is good because it only comes with one <laughs> <Right>. car. <laughs> How do I play? Well, three different ways to play. Oh, we're missing a, um, a smashed car somewhere. Oh, oh the whole thing fell apart. Okay. okay, well now you so, get to see how easy it is you know, to assemble. Do you know what Monster Jam is, Chris? Monster Jam is like truck competition, where you get monster monster yeah. trucks together and they jam. Monster trucks riding, <laughs> riding over yeah, they are. Riding Hello. over cars. Okay, sorry. <sighs> it's that the Monster Derek and the Dominoes. Arenas, you know, like... Sunday, 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 Monster Funny car, yes, yes, yes. okay. Anyway, so you know, it's oh, the same kind of launcher. Oh. I know, see, we can put this up, and I'm just doing this based on the video that I saw June do. Oh, I took down part of whatever that was, the video monitor screen, or, okay, I like that. or I can move this over. Oh, you're gonna I'm jump gonna, the cars? I'm gonna need help, somebody's gonna bring this back you're to me. You're gonna jump, gonna the, jump cars. the cars. Oh, destroyed! Smash those cars, or. Oh, wait, Lori, or, there's a truck here. Oh. Okay, and Ooh, I have to I launch it. This, I have this, to this launch is, it. This is very, this is very, a good day. Oh, I didn't do a very good job, I'm sorry. I gotta, get, I gotta you have to keep the these, what, there we go. Oh, it exploded! An exploding truck. Yay. So that's three ways to play with this. Make sure you hit it hard. You gotta hit, yeah, it, you really gotta hit hard. it really hard for this I'm one. like it, I'm like, see, or you this is really classic boys vehicle play. Lots of mayhem. There you go. Ugh. I love that. I love that. I love that. I love that. This is the kind of stuff that my brothers and I would do forever. We would play with this forever. Yeah. So let me yeah. just let me just let's just get a shot of what happens when the when it does that. So I'm faking it here, but whoops, I'm not faking it here. I'm gonna try and fake it here. There you go, and you get in there. It pops. Up, you know, demolition is so cool. I know. Demolition is the Crash coolest and thing. Crash bash and action. So okay, we're done with that. Uh, what do we got next? Okay. What do we got next? We cars have, and something else. We've, we've got, got a cars. Transformers set. Sweet. Put these get them right there. Get these little yep, guys. Yep. Okay. I have to put them as vehicles first, right? Right. We put them together as vehicles. Okay. They're vehicles. Vehicles. We put them together as vehicles, and we do this. Are we going to battle? We are going to battle. What? So you've got Optimus Prime. I've got Megatron. We set this, them up in here, oh. and you can set your different... You set it at a different length, so you can figure out where where it's gonna go, and okay, we get this spinning. Oh, oh. and then you, and then Crash. they transform. Now this, these are called the uh, what are these called? This is the transformer bot shots, bot shots so, dragon tracks. So these are little bot shots. These guys. are the bot shots. Now the way the bot shots work is they're really easy to assemble. You just turn them back in from a car to a uh, to a. Uh, from a from robot, a robot to, to a car, car, and when you drop it, yeah. when, exactly, it, it transforms. So this is really, really good for kids like, you know, five and up, because it, it's a lot of action, and it's a lot and of there's, play. And there's a little, like, rock, paper, scissors type game, too. They have these little things oh, on their chest that you can, uh, before you battle, right. you can choose what symbol you want to show, and each symbol, you know, the red symbol here, whatever this is, beats, you know, another symbol. So um, it's kind of like, you know, rock beats, what is rock beat? I don't even know. Scissors beats paper. paper, you know that kind of thing. So then, when you when we they, just when, played it, when they, you and I just when played it, open paper, up after scissors. battle, you can say, "Oh, I have this. What do you have? Oh, mine beats yours." And that's how you win. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, again, this is such a simple playset. It's it such is. a simple playset. It's got a suggested retail of twenty-two dollars, and it comes with both vehicles. Thank oh you very my much, gosh. Hasbro. Look at that. So, okay. So, okay. Uh, Ready? Wait, no, Ready? wait. I, Ready? Okay, three, two, one, go. Oh, we missed. But we, we missed. Still, we but still again, missed. it's got a little bit of practice, a little bit of a learning yeah. curve, and really kind of fun. Okay, now, okay. they're trying okay. to bring this in without breaking it. It's it's very large. <laughs> it's very large. Oh, look, I'm getting help. This um, is um, the Cars Stunt Racers. Dynaco I think we're going to need a bigger table. Stunt show. Okay. Stunt set. So now, does this is this part of a an overall line that we it would is. buy? It is. It's part of the. Do cars the Monster Jam trucks fit on racers. there? Oh. 
Jesus it's part of the car stunt racers, and basically this is all about, more than just racing, it's about making your car's characters do different tricks and stunts. Okay. So with this one, you've got three different tracks. Um, so I'll, I'm gonna, you can move this launcher. I'm gonna start it over here. Is it a wind-up launcher? It is a wind-up launcher. You know what that reminds me of? It reminds me of the Evil Knievel stunt cycle from night that. Okay, from a I long gotta do it from ago. over here. You ready? You ready? Watch this. Oh, and he jumped up, and he keeps going. Whoa. Technically, you're supposed to try to get him to land on this. On the Dynaco um, thing. I've oh. never had that happen How in the that time that I've been playing with this. Going? What? How's that? How's he gonna land there? His wheels keep Not going. Possible. Oh, ooh, they are not believers. The crew is not believing well, in this I've one. I've never had it happen. The idea is that you're supposed to experiment with the amount of t uh, the amount of revs you give this. Um, but you know what? I just like it. I just like watching it make a. So the idea jump. would be that. No, oh, it doesn't work. That way. <laughs> no. Fail. Yeah. no. Fail. Fail. Okay. So you can also move this to one of the side tracks, and I'll show you what that looks like. Oh, look, it's gonna, is it gonna go on a little it's rail? It's going to, yes, it's supposed to go okay. on its, um... Let's it's see if we can get a shot of that. Is the Dynaco go... cup in the way? Kind of. Oops, there we go. It's supposed to go on two wheels, so here we this go. This really is a technology from the 70s, the you need that thing. Uh, it's Ow! Not, oh, yeah, yeah, don't do that, it does hurt, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or you can rev it. We get some good revs. Oh, this is what we call in the business a friction motor. And I'm gonna make it spin. That's like the trick that works best. That's kind of cool. Yeah, you can do it on his nose too. <laughs> How much is this? This is $24.99 okay. for ages four and up. Okay. Obviously, you want to play with this with a little bit of open floor space. Uh, yeah. So, and then you can run this through. Sweet. Monster job. You know, all, all we're missing is the ah, oh, distraction. Oh, all we're missing is the giant baby to come through. <laughs> all we're missing is the giant baby to come through. Oh look, there's oh, a yeah. giant destructo baby. There it is. Okay. <laughs> and that's the way I mean, your it's... children will really play with this. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's give away some more stuff. Okay. We got the boys' toy package now because. Ooh. The these no, the baby. Together. The baby is helping us to display these. These are the new Connects Mario Kart Wii uh, from Connects. Uh, just a great way to build the figures from from Mario Kart. Yeah, and they're bikes. Mario, Mario, <laughs> Mario, and Mario. Wario. Okay. I, I Wario. have a Wario video game on my Nintendo DS. We've got another Shrinky Dinks creativity kit. This? this one is Spider Man. Spider -Man. Oh, this is really cool. Good luck. I I nice got it. Cash. Hot Wheels Ballistics. Ballistics came out last year yep. and really just a you know fun way to play. Wait, and what's the first thing you showed for the next again? The Mario. Mario. There we go. Mario. Thank you. Thank you. And the Dragon Destroyer. The Dragon Destroyer from Hot Wheels. So you can try uh, destroying the dragon in your own home. Chop, chop. Chop, chop. So how do I get these? Go to timetoplaymag.com and click on the play date where you'll find all the rules to enter. It is free to enter and you have until Wednesday, February 27th at midnight Eastern time. So have a great week. Thanks for dropping by to play with us. We will be back next week with lots more cool toys.